Welcome back to Let's Play Resident Evil Code Veronica. In the last episode, we fought the Shocky Creature, and we picked up the Iron Plate, which we dissolved, and got the Halberd. Awesome. Now, what do we do with this thing? Looks like a middle eight. Okay. What are we going to do with this thing? Because it doesn't really seem like we can... I mean, we can't use it as a weapon or anything. I'll tell you what you can do with it. Simple fact that, remember when we were... when Alfred was escaping from the island before it blew up, he used a plate like that to go and unlock a sort of door to get into the, uh... ship. That's not gonna work out for me. I'm gonna, I, I need space in the inventory to get this. Don't worry about that spider too much. The AI in this game sucks. Pretty sure it may not have been able to follow you if you weren't moving or something like that. Anyway, he used that halberd to go and unlock a door, which gave him access to a room where a Harrier jet was. Now maybe Chris can do the same thing. Before we go too far, there's a couple of things that I need to take care of. For example, we don't have the shotgun. So how are we going to go and get the shotgun? Well, let's go and find out. This whole shotgun thing is a bit of a pain in the ass, and you don't want to leave it behind. You leave your shotgun behind, and you leave it behind you with better weapons. And it is an irritating thing that it is possible in this game to leave weapons behind. Anything that you left in the, like, the metal detector box as well would have been left behind. And after Claire left the island, Chris would not have been able to pick that stuff up. Zero would remember. Oh, where we can go. They would remember that you could go and drop weapons anywhere you wanted, and it was possible for weapons to become inaccessible after that. But ordinarily, I guess they expected. Oh shit! They kind of expected people to uh, not drop a weapon until they were sure they didn't need it anymore. Like once you ran out of ammunition for the weapon, the weapon was useless. To you. It was pretty much the way it was supposed to work. Red herbs are no good on their own. They can uh, be useful when you add them to your I don't think there's anything down there for me to get, so I'm going to let that guy just move around. Oh, look where we are. We just came out of that friggin' manhole we couldn't get through before. Uh, magic item box is in here. We're going to go and use that. say we drop these these red herbs in the box or at least one of them have green and red so I can combine them we have our shotgun now so let's go pull out our shotgun ammunition and uh, I think we're gonna be good there there we go three open inventory spaces there's a puzzle over here I never got at let's go check this out Correct drawer sequence would be um, red. Nothing. How about green? Nothing. Jeez. Blue. Oh, something. Wh which one is it? Brown, I bet you. Sweet. Now, what are we gonna do with this? I mean, this is a replica. I mean. Can't be used as a weapon. What good is that? Ah, whatever. I'll stick it in the magic item box. Well, I'm here. I do have some more uh, pistol ammunition. Why don't I just bring that out? I'm also gonna need this. Oh, 
sure I've collected everything there is to collect in on the island and let's get the hell out of here. Going to slap this in the door and we're good. Oh how terribly convenient. I suppose Chris knows how to fly it too. Hold on, Claire. I'll save you. Well, I guess he does. It's cool that this thing doesn't need any maintenance or refueling or anything. He almost took his wings off while going out of that door, too. 